double the cost. All right. Now, great, great question. So I come from, um, I won't say which fellowship, but I go to a 12-step food fellowship where I share um, in that that I'm 13 years out now, 13 years absent, I have to try to remember, 13 years abstinent. And um, and uh, have been, apart from one day in the last um, 11 years, been in neutrality around food. Uh, there was one day when there was a tiny um, event with food in the last um, 11 years. Yeah. So that neutrality with, uh, with the thinking of the body being fat and whatever and, um, and, and food items having allure. Now, I, 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 use, I often say that that would feel like transcendence for me. However, it's not the level of transcendence. Well, you see, if you use words, they're not accurate that Hawkins had where he's eating donuts and ice cream and chocolates and, and whatnot, and, and there's no effect. So, um, so what I meant when I used the, like someone asked me about this, what do I mean by a transcending? And I avoid sugar. Like if someone says to me, here's a donut, eat it, um, then I'll, I'll say, no, thank you. Uh, being part of a 12 step fellowship. Uh, so here's the thing, I guess I, I'll, I have to use language and you can catch me up on the language not being accurate, but all languaging is not, so I have to say it practically. Um, it's easy to let go of something like donuts by not eating and transcending the feelings and thoughts about it being magical so that you don't really see it. And there's not really a wantingness of it any longer or thoughts about it. And to not also eat the donuts at the same time, to have the level of transcendence, which Hawkins had, um, which is like, well, oh, there's a donut. Uh, thanks. I'll just, yeah, everyone's having 10 donuts, not a problem. I'll have 10 donuts as well. And that, that being meaningless, uh, like it's not existing because you're in the infinite, you know, you're in the infinite realm um, and that's happening. So that's not that. Now, I, uh, I've had like uh, lots of miracles, thanks to the Holy Spirit, to God. Um, with illnesses leaving, which is quite miraculous. I mean, really, really extraordinary. Uh, I, I didn't, I don't, my ego doesn't take credit for what happened with those. So there, it, it's beyond, the miracles are beyond what seem to be the laws of this world. So why aren't I eating, why am I not eating donuts? Well, in order to transcend, transcend something like a physical illness, which is such a heavy belief, like you've got organ failure or you can't breathe with asthma or you having to use walking sticks because of gout attacks. You know, it took me to, to now I didn't do it, not the ego, but for the miracle to happen that uh, those illnesses left three to five years of work. So, um, so of cancelling, you know, every day for three to five years. So, you know, to let go, uh, to say no to donuts, uh, no thanks, means there's going to be less work to do the work of being able to eat donuts and ice creams and not have it affect or exist would mean a few, probably a few more years of work. I'm trying to explain, like in the end of the day, to have full transcendence around something, even to the effect that the physical laws of, they're not really laws, the illusions, the magical ideas of this world have no existence. It's like, um, so you, the ego will come up with like, well, I can stab you with a knife right now and that won't affect you, you know? So it will be stuff like that. So. So I've not, uh, I've not had the inclination, shall we say, and that's dualistic language, to, you know, do the work in eating donuts so that I can say to people, um, you see this donut, I'm putting it in my mouth, no effect. You want to give me an ice cream? No problem. So I'll stop the video there. Uh, oh, saying it now. Press stop. Press stop.